and in this video I am going to discuss Riverox torque metering systems. Today we are going to cover the types of torque meters we offer, the basic functionality of those systems, and the benefits of a torque meter system on your coupling or shaft. A common question that comes up in discussion is why do I need to measure torque or why should it be included in my spec? Torque meters deliver many benefits over time. They provide direct measurement of power transmitted, they monitor your machinery's efficiency, and which tends to lead to significant savings, and torque meters serve as ideal predictive monitors and can help provide indications of other problems in your machinery. Lastly, torque meters can be used to help schedule shutdowns and turnarounds in your plant. So Riverhawk offers several different types of torque meters. Our standard system, the RDT2100, is a robust system for high performance applications. It is a strain gauge design that is tried and true. The system measures torque, speed, and power. Our dynamic torque meter is identical to our standard system, the RDT2100, but with upgraded capability to be able to measure uh, torsional vibration. The system allows users to capture real-time instantaneous torque, peak torque values, and alternating peak to peak torque values. Riverhawk also has experience in providing custom torque meter solutions as well. Examples of custom solutions include systems that not only measure torque, but real-time shaft alignment, shipboard applications, and lower performance applications. Moving on to the basic functionality of the Riverhawk torque meter, our system consists of four different components. The first component is the strain gauges installed inside the coupling tube or on the drive shaft. The next component is the stator that wraps around the coupling tube and is attached to the coupling guard. Our ESC or excitation signal conditioner is located adjacent to the coupling um, in an explosion proof box. Lastly, there is a monitor which is attached to the ESC and located in a, a control room further down the road. Each component is driven by the next. The monitor provides power to the ESC via cables run from the control room. The ESC provides power to the coupling electronics, which in turn provides sig the signal. That signal is sent back through the ESC for conditioning. Once that is complete, the ESC sends the information back to the monitor for calibration. Now that you have a better appreciation for the flow of information from the coupling, let's look at some of the components closer. On this coupling, you will see the fiberglass tape that is installed on the coupling spacer tube. Normally we need about six inches of space on the coupling tube that you'll see here. The fiberglass protects the copper wires which are installed underneath the tape and those copper wires act as a transformer to power the strain gauges installed on the inside of the tube. The strain gauges measure the torque transmitted from the coupling. So here you'll see this is where we would install the strain gauge. They go around the coupling. They are wired through the coupling to the other end of the coupling where our electronics puck um, is also installed. The torque meter uses strain, strain gauge and Hall effect sensors to measure torque and rotational speed in the coupling. It uses these two parameters to calculate the power. Torque, speed, and power are displayed on the monitor and are also transmitted via the 4 to 20 milliamp outputs provided. Our competitors will require the spacer tube to be, to be replaced or significantly modified, which greatly affects the overhung moment of the coupling as well as cost. Our system does not require this. The last component of the torque meter I want to discuss is the stator. This component attaches to the coupling guard as an, and is suspended with an air gap around the fiberglass installed on the spacer tube. You're going to use these two ears to attach to the coupling guard and this will align the stator to allow for an air gap between the rotor and the stator. Riverhawk system offers the least obtrusive system available on the market. As mentioned, the coupling requires minimal modifications and the added weight to the coupling is insignificant. After manufacturing, the last step at Riverhawk before shipment is final test and calibration. Riverhawk has a 10 million inch pound static test stand in our lab. The torque meter works at zero RPM and does not need to go up to speed to capture startup torque. Each torque meter is calibrated per customer application. This calibration ensures better accuracy in the field. Aside from some of the benefits previously noted, the Riverhawk system provides several advantages over other systems on the market. Our torque meter works with most available couplings with minor modifications. Because of the strain gauge design, there is a reduced weight compared to other torque meters on the market, as well as no gear teeth to generate windage or heat within the coupling guard. 
it is also less sensitive to centrifugal effects from speed. The Riverhawk torque meter has a lower total installed cost because there is no need to change the spacer tube and there is no special coupling guard design requirements. This leads to a simple and lightweight coupling design. Our system is also Class 1 Div 2 certified. Another benefit to working with Riverhawk is our ability to offer the entire package. Not only do we design and manufacture torque meters, but we also design and manufacture our own line of diaphragm couplings and accessories. With the ability to control the coupling manufacturing process, it will also reduce total cost and lead time compared to the competition. For more information on couplings, please visit our website at www.riverhawk.com or our YouTube page and watch Pat McCormick's presentation on Riverhawk couplings. Thank you for taking the time to view this presentation. If you have any questions or would like to further discuss our torque meter products or our couplings and accessories, please feel free to reach out via email, our website, or phone. For the Riverhawk Company, I'm Sean LaPola. Thank you for watching.